hello so this is the last part that you want to do rendering or visualization and i don't know which software you're okay with uh, for me maybe i'm okay with using lumion i'm okay with using twinmotion as well as atlantis and in this one we're going to use um, twinmotion so i'm going to show you how you can be able to export your drawing from a key card to twin motion how you can connect with the direct link there is a video that i uploaded already that shows how you can be able to download the direct link and install it and activate it and for this part we're just going to show how you can be able to export it maybe we can go back a little i already have the direct link with me here but let me just show you how you can activate it if you have already installed it all you have to do is you go to when you are in 3d like this i can go to options uh, i mean you go to window then you go to palettes and let me do something first So you go to window then you go to palettes and you go here at the bottom you'll be able to see data smith so if i go to window then palettes and data smith i can be able to activate it to be on and once you have it on you can then try to adjust the position that you want it to be for me at the moment i'm okay with it being there but you can place it where you want it to be according to your how you feel it okay then so i'm going to start to in motion so i go to Ep epic games so let's wait to start your twin motion from epic epic games i already also showed a tutorial now you can be able to install twin motion i will be able to leave a link so that you can go and watch it so i'm using version 2023.1.2 which is educational version yeah educational version of course if you have you can you can be able to use professional or any other versions that you like okay so then i'm going to templates i want to open my drawing within this template of the night skies because it already has some cool backgrounds in terms of the sky dome so i don't want to go and have to download my own sky and stuff once i open it i come to import you click on import then you click on this plus icon or addition icon and you go to direct link you have geometry you have direct link you have landscape you have point cloud so what do you want to import at this moment i want a direct link so that i can connect my akika drawing with my twin motion directly you get the point then if you come here you see the name of my my drawing is class so when you come to the direct link here if you have opened a number of twin motion drawings a number of akika drawings you will be able to see their names here if you click this drop down menu it will show you how many drawings you have so all you have to do is just to click on the one that you want for me in this case i want a keycard class okay then uh, here you can either collapse by material collapse all or col keep hierarchy if you collapse by material it means that once you once you when you're into motion and select any component like let me show you an example with AkiCAD. if i collapse by material it means once i come and select here it will select the old drawing the all it will select the old drawing so it also won't give you a lot of room in, in terms of playing around with it so you want to keep hierarchy when you keep hierarchy yeah you want to keep hierarchy when you keep hierarchy you can be able to select each item on its own and delete it or modify it so it depends with what you want also later on i'll show you how you can be able to, to do facing and with that it will be better if you use keep hierarchy I'll, there is a video that i'll put here of a tutorial that i want to do and if you're interested i'll say it. if you're interested just tell me in the comment section that you're interested in the same and i'll be able to do it now all this we can leave them to be uh, we can leave them to be if you want you can activate them then light settings use original enable substitution no 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 so let me click on import 
so once you click on import actually nothing happens you don't see anything here so you have to go to akikad and send now the drawing to akikad so you come you already have this this is one you want you want to synchronize now with your twin motion so once i click on synchron synchronize and i come to twin motion it will automatically pick it for me okay that's how you do it and now we are in twin motion so i feel like ending this first tutorial here then when we come to the next one we just begin from twin motion directly okay let me end this one here for the time being because i feel like this is just another part the part of importing it makes a lot of people have some issues and for me i like to do series but my series is is in such a way that if you have a certain problem and you open a certain tutorial you don't have to have followed from the first part but if you just open that section alone that if it's part 11 and you only open part 11 then if you have a specific problem it's going to solve it for you at that particular time so see you in the next one